So today we're going to be making max profit here because we're going to be opening up our own game store here in Game Store Simulator. And folks, we're going to need to run GameStop out of business. So stay tuned until the end to see how much profit we make. Hit that thumbs up button and let's jump in. Oh my goodness, this is an absolute freaking mess. There's a freaking anchor setting in the middle of my game store. Um, okay, we just need to remove the trash. Uh, wait, where did I stick that? Uh, that is a good question. So yeah, uh, we bought this very, very terrible looking, wait, what is blocking this? Hold on, is that a storeroom or something? I believe it is. But yeah, we bought a terrible game shop that we're totally gonna take out GameStop with. We're totally not gonna rip you off on your trades. Uh, you know, giving you $10 for a $60 game and then reselling it for 55. But enough with bashing GameStop. Let's get this place cleaned up. Um, it is really bare looking right now. Wait, what the heck? I can, wait, I've got a vehicle, this is mine? Wait, I can actually pop the, okay. Uh, hold on, I'm not sold on the game yet. Can I run over pedestrians? That's always the question I have. Oh my goodness, what is that camera? Wait, hold on, and... Uh, wait, there it goes, yes! 10 out of 10, Komodo can run over pedestrians. I'm happy now. So yeah, I think I gotta go to somebody else's like game supply store and order. I'm assuming this is like wholesale, like... What does this mean? Am I am I buying games from your store to sell in my store? Um, that's kind of weird. All right, what you got? Uh, you got puzzle games, builder games, uh, platformers. Uh, I want a, a lot of, wait, actually I only have $320. I gotta watch how much I purchase. Okay, let's get a little bit of everything. So we'll get 20 of each. Uh, actually, I don't know if I can add that much. Here, we'll buy that. Uh, can I buy some more? Hold on, oh no, it's locked right now. I think I have to first deal in this. And then we just place this here in the back. And I think we need to go, uh, wait, do I have anywhere? Oh, I need to buy a shelf. That's why it wouldn't let me buy any more games. Oh, and Sarah, do you sell shelves here? Okay, shelves, here we go. Store shelf, and then you have a warehouse shelf. Uh, let's go ahead and add, can I do two of these? Okay, boom. All right, so we got these. Oh, can I carry two boxes at once? Yes, I can, nice. Okay, so we're gonna set these back here. We sell like one type of game right now. Wait, why does this sound like a Jetsons car? It kind of does when I hit reverse. Nice. Okay, so we need to go back to the store. We'll set up the shelves. We'll stick the games on there. And then boom, profit, right? That's how these work. Also, I did not check. It's a simulator game. Do I have a tablet uh, where I can, like, gamble and take out loans? Uh, that seems to be a thing, too. Hold on, we need to go to the loading zone here. Keep clear. Uh, we'll pull the vehicle up. Wait, can I open up this warehouse? Oh, heck yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, so let's see, open trunk. Uh, what box is this? Is this, uh, I'm assuming this is games. This will just place these here for now. Okay, so I think it wants me to, okay, take a shelf. All right, so I need to set up shelves here in our store. Okay, we're gonna place these right here. There we go. And then now we can interact with the shelf and I have platformer games. So I have 20 of these. It cost me $6, so is $10 unreasonable? I don't think it is, right? Average price, oh, it's average price is $12. Can we get $13 out of these? Let's place these, and then boom, we just stack the games up on the shelf here, boom. Oh, and I got one more shelf. I might as well go ahead and stick out here. I think it's this one, right? Oh, it's this one. Okay, so we wanna place this right here. Let's get it even with the other shelf, boom. All right, so we have two shelves in. Uh, I don't have a ton of games right now. Uh, I don't even know why I still have this box. Do I still have more in the back storage? Uh, wait, are people starting to... Uh, wait, you guys not like my selection? I have sweet platformers, you know? Okay, so it did say I need to watch out for thieves, so I do have a baseball bat that I can hit people. Hold on, let's test it out on a customer real quick. Okay, can confirm does work. Needs more decorations. So they're giving me suggestions. W what do you think? Hey, buy a game! <laughs> Every customer that doesn't buy a game, I bonk you in the head with a bat. Maybe my game prices are too expensive. All right, well, I think the game wants me to end the day. And here we go, we got like a Windows 98 computer, nice. All right, real estate. Oh, I can upgrade to bigger stores, dude. That's actually kind of cool. All right, so we could do that. Uh, we can hire workers and stuff eventually. So I need a skill tree uh, thing for that. We have online uh, sales. Here's our skill tree here. Okay, this is a little bit deeper than I thought it was initially. Uh, and then we have income reports here, nice. Oh yeah, I need to sell until the end of the day. I thought it wanted me to end it. Hold on, I need to readjust the price here. Uh, wait, that guy just grabbed something. Oh my goodness, we're gonna make our first sale. Hold on, let's, let's set here. Wait, what did, did you just dump trash on my floor? What is wrong with you? Okay, 
platformer uh, selling. So we got $7 profit. Uh, okay, wait, how do I do this? Oh, something just happened. All right, well, I guess I sold it. Uh, I do like that on the computer, it pulls up uh, like what your profit margin is, which is nice. Uh, everybody seems to be complaining about decorations. They're not complaining about the game types that I have up here, even though I think I should have a ton more game types. Uh, okay, uh, let's see, $7, there we go. All right, we are officially making money in our game store right now. I'm super excited for this. Uh, you guys could always hit the thumbs up button if you want to see more of it. What is that person? If you're a thief, you're not doing a very good... Yep. The guy was totally about to steal something. Hey, you sh I just helped you with that. You know what? Oh, okay. I couldn't bonk that lady. Not going to lie. I'm going to be addicted to hitting my customers. Uh, it's probably not a good thing for business, but it's fine. So yeah, I think eventually we'll get to place down some more shelves, some decorations, do online sales. Uh, I'm actually kind of excited for this. Uh, we really need to go buy some different styles of games. Because all we got is platformers. Which paid price is $6. Selling it for $13. So that's a $7 profit per game. Which I don't think that's too bad. Uh, we are gaining XP. I probably need to check the skill tree. Uh, what can we do? So there's some vehicle stuff. Physics. Increase game uh, limit of boxes. And then... Oh, increase customer satisfaction. How much does this cost? Okay, 30 XP. I want more customer satisfaction. Dang it. I need help. Oh, this person needs help. What do you need help with? A game where we run and jump to me is necessary. If it's 2D, it'll be perfect. Which category you think is suitable for me? Oh, we can help him. Well, I mean, all I've got is platformers. So here you go, platformer game. All right, you better buy one of those, dang it. Oh, look, they actually... Okay, I'm not threatening you with a bat. I'm, I'm glad you purchased this. So I like that you actually get to go, like, answer customers' uh, questions. That's pretty neat. All right, well, we are closed for the day. I would say that was a fairly successful first day for our game store. So let's go ahead and close it. So we're net profit, we're negative 112, but that was because of the purchases that we made uh, and the expenses between the taxes, the store shelf, and you can see the platformer games that we bought. So I would say that's a decent uh, first day, but we need more games in this store. All right, it's morning. Uh, the game store is open. Yeah, I don't have anybody to actually like watch over this thing. I, I need to go into town. And I know a lot of people are complaining about decorations, which I want to get to that, but I need like one more type of game here. There are multiple game stores. There's a decoration store, gas station. There's a car dealership. Oh, sweet. I think I might have just run somebody over or a hot dog stand. Oh, that was a car. Okay, do not look at map while driving. Okay, we're back. Can I buy games now? Yes, I can. Okay, cool. So I'm going to add 10 building games and let's go ahead and get 10 of the puzzle games here. Uh, that way we can get a little bit more variety. So there we go. Uh, wait, did I buy both of those? I guess they stuffed them all in one box here, so I think we're good. Uh, regardless, it's a different style of game that we have to put in the store. Also, you do have to go buy gas and stuff in the game. I think there was upgrades to make it where you use less gas. I'm assuming that's an issue. Uh, wait, where's my gas gauge? Oh, I, it was here somewhere. Alright, we'll go to that decoration store here in a little bit. I wonder what they got in there. They gotta have some cool stuff. Okay, no, don't leave my store. Oh my goodness, somebody's doing the chicken dance again. What is wrong with you? How many people do I have to hit with a bat in my store? Seems a little odd, doesn't it? All right, uh, let's get this box. Let's get some more games on the shelf. You guys need to keep buying my games, please. Jeez, people are just ridiculous. Okay, so uh, popularity isn't too high on these, but let's go $11 on the platformers. Uh, boom. Uh, oh, I want to... Wait, why can I not fill this up with platforming games? Uh, we got people up here. here I'm making sales here. Uh, boom. Boom, I need to fill this up. Need more decoration. Okay, that's a weird complaint to have in a game store. Uh, I mean, I guess I get it, but if you're not going to buy a game because I'm lacking decorations, you've got, you got other issues, I think. Okay, building games. Uh, average price, let's go $13. Can I place these? Okay, there we go. The building games are up. Okay, I think that's all I actually bought were builders. Uh, there we go. Sell that there. Uh, I don't think I have... Yeah, I don't have any more platforming. So, you, don't, you I guess you can only purchase one thing at a time, and you have to separate them in the boxes. Uh, that's fine. We have a little bit more variety here for our customers. And I think the profit margin on that is still close to the same. So, up to 133 bucks. So, after this day, I'm going to stay in the store for the rest of the day, because obviously, uh, I need to pay attention uh, to the customers and the crooks. But I do want to go to the decoration store, and I want to buy another type of game. Uh, it does seem like I, nobody's bought the builders yet. Uh, everybody seems to be buying like the other style of game, the platformer. So maybe that's what we need to do. And oh, there's another thief coming. Uh, we need upgrades for security systems here. Because like this is happening way too often. <laughs> also really happy I didn't hit the wrong person. Hold on, somebody needs help here. Uh, hello? 
I'm um, the kind of game that will simulate to me. Wait, what? Can you help me, please? I don't have simulator games, but have you checked out our building games? I don't want the game in this category. Well, you know what? There you go. Hey, look, somebody bought a builder game. Boom, there you go. Dude, we're making money pretty quick now. We can also upgrade these shelves, by the way. Hold on, let's go to this. So upgrade for 20 bucks. Oh, it makes them taller. I like that. Uh, so can we name the game store? Like, is there an option for a sign or something? We need an option for a sign. I want to name this. Uh, not a scam game store. Another customer needs help. Which category do you think would be suitable for me? I always wish to make sandcastles. But oh, building games. Uh, no doubt. Buy you one of those building games. They're really good. Heck, that's originally what Komodo played on his channel was building games. And then he realized he sucked at building. I was good at building, like, buildings, though. Just not cars. <laughs> I was awful at that. Okay, game store is officially closed. All right, so now I don't have to worry about people coming in and robbing me. So now we can head over to, like, the decoration store and... Well, I say I don't have to worry about people robbing me. Why are you still able to come? Hey, get get out of here. This is absolutely rude. Also, I really, I'm already curious about what, like, what vehicles they have in the game. Uh, can I buy a Porsche 911, please? Also, we need, like, houses in the game, like a player house. I don't know if that is a thing or not. I think you just pretty much end the day at the store. All right, what do we got in here? Uh... Okay, when I was thinking of decorations for a game store, wasn't necessarily thinking about what's... I mean, that's not bad. A gumball machine. Okay, is this your actual decorations? Oh, here we go. Uh, cafe chairs. Oh, dude. A game table? Like, come on. That feels like that fits, right? All right, let's do a trash can and a game table here. It's $90. That still saves us plenty of money uh, to buy some more stuff for the store itself. Uh, I feel like I like both of those. All right, so we'll buy that. I wonder if it actually decreases the amount of trash uh, that appears in your store now. Uh, also, there's a couple other game stores we haven't hit up to see what kind of, like, games they have. I'm hoping we got some shooters and stuff. So, it's Abigail, so it's the next street over. All right, so we need to head there, and we need to just keep selling games, getting that XP up. That way, hopefully, we can unlock maybe workers soon. Uh, something like that would be kind of cool. Hey, look, there's, like, a repair station. I wonder if you could, like, upgrade your car. I think that'd be kind of cool, too. Like, there's a, a lot of possibility here. It is an early access uh, so I know some features aren't here. I know there's like a bank and stuff that hasn't been finished. Uh, okay, what kind of games do you sell here? Ooh, racing games. I mean, some of my favorite types. And simulators! Uh, we're doing a simulator inside of a simulator. Okay, so if we add that, I can only buy one type. I think I'm going to do racing games here. Uh, I guess, can I add less than... Oh, I can do per game here. So I can actually add more. So let's add that. So that's $90 worth of games now. So there we go. All right, we got plenty of stock now. We got a good variety. I would like to find like a FPS because obviously that's, I think, probably the most popular style of game right now uh, in the world. I mean, I could be wrong. What do you guys think is the most popular game? I, I think it's got to be FPS games or just shooters in general. I guess you shouldn't say FPS because stuff like Fortnite, I think it's uh, third person. So I would say just shooters in general. That's the most popular style of game. Okay, loading zone. All right, let's get this stuff uh, unload it real quick. Boom, boom. Uh, put these on our shelves. By the way, I just now noticed the box icon kind of tells you what it is. So like this is furniture, so we need to place this in here. Little trash can, put it right by the store entrance. I don't know if they're actually gonna use it. I'm hoping they do. And then of course we got our gaming table in here, which I'm excited about this. I don't know, I mean, it'd be cool if they used it. It might just be decor. Uh, we'll put shelves, like, in the center, but maybe we'll have, like, a nice little corner where people can go, like, uh, mingle. So, there we go. Uh, pack. Oh, let's pack it back into the box. And then, last but not least, let's go ahead and select some of these. So, average price for racing games is 14 so obviously I want to make a little more. Their popularity is really high on these right now. Uh, so let's go ahead and stack those up. There we go. And then simulators, popularity is really high on these, too. Uh, we'll go, let's see if we can get 13 bucks out of these. There we go. And then we'll place these on the bottom here. All right, so all we got to do is run the actual store today. Uh, definitely want to, hold on, let's check our upgrades here. What do we have? Uh, increases game limit of boxes. That's kind of a good one, I would think. A box carrying. Uh, you got stuff for, like, reduces taxes. The prices of the games you buy will drop. That's a good one. Uh, the 40... Okay, there is the allows you to get workers. That's 40 XP and then allows to sell over the internet. I kind of like that. Let's do the selling games on the internet before we do the customers. Uh, also, I hear somebody in here. Uh, oh, I thought people were doing something bad. Needs more decoration. We have a freaking game table. Also, you guys are still littering. 
Come on, man. You got to use the, the trash can, please. All right, so now we have the ability to sell games online. I don't know what that looks like right now. Uh, internet? Uh, online sales. Oh, look. So we got requests now to sell our games online. Oh, that's actually freaking cool. Uh, trying to figure out... Wait, do I not have three racing games? Hold on. I got people up here trying to buy... Uh, oh my goodness, I got people disturbing other customers. Stop that. Yeah, I gotta figure out how this online system works. Uh, price, okay, so when I click select, nothing happens. Maybe the games, ooh, I bet you they have to be in the warehouse for you to be able to do this. So I think we need to keep that stock. That's good, though. Like, we can start making some online, uh, sales. Alright, let's talk to this person. I can't decide whether to give a game I could build. Which category? Okay, you want a building game. Uh, I got that settled. If I have some on... Oh, yeah, I do have them on the shelf. Okay, so the day is over. I real quick want to go back to Abigail's, and I want to buy some more racing games. They're really flying off the shelves right now. Plus, I want to try to make one of those online uh, offers, because it feels like for three games, their payment is $65, and I think we're only paying like $11 a game, so that's like a little bit more profit than what we're making... I believe on the standard shelves so I feel like we definitely need to do that plus I can buy more decorations uh, I like how this is progressing I, I don't know like how long until you reach the basically the end of the game uh, but I'm hoping they continue to add stuff here okay so I need let's add I really just need three of these but I guess we'll add a little bit more I can stick some more on the shelves and then maybe some more simulators. We might have to hold off on buying more decorations here. I think game stock is obviously the biggest thing that you want. Decorations are nice and all, but I mean, if you ain't got games at your game store, uh, what's wrong with you? Oh my goodness, I just ran out of fuel. Um, I was not paying attention to my fuel gauge. Uh, all right, we are rolling. Um, that is a thing. I might be parking this on the side of the road. Or is the gas stations up here? Or is it back there? Oh my goodness, I just hit something. All right, well, we're just gonna walk here. It's fine. I uh, use the exercise here in the games. Just walk this way. You know, the sad thing is, I think I was at a full tank of gas. Gas burns extremely fast in the game. Uh, it might be worth upgrading the uh, vehicle to where it burns less gas. I wonder if you can get electric vehicle in the game. We need like a charge station or something. So I find it odd. There's like this parking lot across the street. I wonder if eventually they're gonna, they're gonna do something with that. All right, let's place these up here. Uh, let's go ahead and take that online order real quick. Oh, that one was gone. Oh, and let's try the Matthew King. Uh, so select. Okay, so I selected those. So the net profit's 46. So he really only wanted three, but I guess I'm going to give him more. I don't know. Uh, all I know is I'm making 46 bucks. So sure, we did that. So would you look at us just doing the thing? By the way, I need to get rid of some of those boxes. So some of them have like zero in it. So, But we have a new type of game. We have strategy games. Not extremely popular, but... I like having a a, a, select, a good selection of games. There we go. That's somewhat stocked here. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. I think it's actually pretty cool. And maybe we're going to play some more of this here in the future.